Today has been such a cozy day. It has been so dark and gloomy outside and it just started raining. So if you can hear the rain, I'm sorry, but I am living for this type of day. This is like my favorite type of weather. We should be getting a cold front, so I am super excited about that. Oh, I love this weather. I love the thunder. So today I wanted to record a what's in my bag just because I kind of need to clean it out and I thought it would be fun to like go through what I have in my purse just because I've always been the type of person that I love, love watching what's in my bag type of videos. I've noticed that recently it has been a kind of little trend on TikTok to do a what's in my bag. So I thought why not bring it back to YouTube and do a what's in my bag video. So let's go ahead and just get started. I have a Chloe bag that I bought off of the reel last year this was my first purchase buying through the reel and honestly i was very surprised at the quality of how the bag came so like i mentioned i did get this bag last year it was a little birthday gift to myself so before this bag i had the louis vuitton never full and i just felt like it was too much for me and i wanted something smaller something that was just going to be crossbody something more simple just because i don't like to carry a lot with me but i've noticed that i am someone that no matter what type of purse I have I'm always going to fill it to the very brim and this purse is filled so it doesn't matter how much I downsize I still end up with a lot of things in my purse but I really do love this purse it has like the cute little gold hardware and it also has like this little chain that was actually attached to this but it was just getting in my way anytime I was opening my purse throw this to the side so I just moved it and put it on the strap and it's fine it doesn't really bother me um but yeah you open it and it has three different little compartments into the purse so it is very roomy but it also gets very heavy like my bag is really heavy i could probably knock somebody <laughs> out of it so let's go ahead and just start like with what's in the front pocket first i have these Starface little patches i have like the blue ones I love these. Anytime a pimple is forming or I catch a little blemish, I literally just pop it on and like by the next day, it feels like it's deflated a lot more. So I definitely love those. Then I just have some Kleenex because you just never know when you need Kleenex. I have a gum wrapper. <laughs> I have a hair tie. I have this cute little pink shell. Um, I'm not sure where I bought it, but I usually like to put like pills in here so like if I'm not feeling good I'll put like just some medication in here that way I have it on hand um next I have uh 50 cents uh 51 cents I also have like this is so weird I have nails in my purse my mom wanted to hang up some pictures so she asked me to bring some nails and then we never got around to doing that so <laughs> okay so that was it for the first one I think, oh, there is just a little dime that was hiding in the corner. But I really like it because it's spacious. So usually I like to put my phone here. That way, like, it's like easy access. Now let's go into the middle section, which is a lot larger. And it's where it carries more, more things. So I have a little Hello Kitty pouch that carries my change. Next, I have a pen, which always comes in handy. Then I have my car keys and I have this little keychain that says strong as hell. I bought this in Denver when I went a couple years back and I really love it. I also have like this little embroidered C that has a cute little tassel at the end. My cousin brought this back from Mexico for me and I love it. So keep it pretty simple. I have my car keys and just my mom's house key. Okay, so next, <laughs> this is so weird. So I have a gold C little hardware thing that I bought and I just put in my purse because I I don't even remember why I have it in my purse. I recently just watched Sex in the City for the first time, like the full complete series, and I noticed that Carrie had a C on her apartment door, and I wasn't sure if it was because her name is Carrie or because it's just apartment C. Like I know some apartments have like unit A, unit B, unit C, but I loved it so much, and I was like, I wanna get a C from my door, so I think I might have took it to show my mom, I'm not sure, but yeah, I have it in here, and I need to put it up on my door. Then I have like a little Hello Kitty mirror then I have a lip glow oil by Dior and this one is in mahogany I love this color I feel like it's just like a perfect fall color then I have a Bath and Body Works hand sanitizer in the scent sunshine and lemons and it smells really good it smells very clean then I have some more gum wrappers I have a Purell hand sanitizing wipe I have a cute little perfume this is the lotus flower balm it smells very good it is 
it smells so fresh and clean. Then I have a lip gloss and this is Lauren Conrad's lip gloss. So like one thing about me is I loved Laguna Beach. I was obsessed with the hills. Like my goal in life was to be like Lauren Conrad. So when I saw that she came out with like her own makeup line, I did buy a couple of things and I love her lip gloss. When you put it on your lips, like it just gives you like a perfect gloss. It does not feel like sticky at all. And then I have this old Lancome Juicy Tube and this is like just disgustingly old that I probably shouldn't wear it but I love it because it's like a pinky glittery lip gloss and it makes your lips look so pink and glittery and I love it. Then I have a Gucci lipstick. This is in Peggy Taupe. It's just another dark lipstick and I really love it. Like it is just such a beautiful color. Like I said, I love dark lip colors if you can't tell. And then I have more change. I have a dollar and quarter and a penny. <laughs> That's why I carry this. There you go. And then again, I have another like flat head and a cross screw. I'm not sure what this is called. Um, like I said, I was supposed to help my mom hang some stuff up and I just tossed it in my purse. That was it for that pouch. And now for the last one, there's another quarter in there. There's a lot of quarters in here. There's also like a little pocket in here that I just keep like my own house key. I have a Kroger uh, membership card. So this is my wallet. It's YSL and it's just a black leather. In this little front pocket, I keep all my gums. And then I entered a raffle. In this big one, I have some more lip glosses. This is the Laneige, Laneige, I'm not sure. I just still don't know how to pronounce it. It's the same one that I used in my previous video, but just the tube form. And then I just have an Aquaphor lip gloss. My lips get really dry, so I have to constantly put on like lip balm to like keep them moisturized. Um, then I have a dollar bill. I have one of these batteries that's for my car keys, and I need to change it because every time I get in my car, I get a little warning that the battery for my key is low so I need to change that. <laughs> I just haven't done it. And then of course I have more change. I truly don't know where all this change comes from. More change in a year. Then there's another little pocket all the way back here and in here which is more change. Jesus. I just carry my driver's license, my mom's insurance, my debit card, and my cousin's business card because she does brows and lashes. So I like to just keep those in here. But yeah, that was pretty much it. That was inside of my purse. I have everything empty. So now I can go ahead and clean this and just put everything that needs to go in here back and get rid of whatever doesn't need to go back in here. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you in the next one.